What up, y'all? It's your boy. Um, I'm back to a lot of to actually prove a few things to some people. You know, there's been a lot of controversy, you know, going around saying that, oh, he steals beats, or oh, your girl said you steal beats, or said you did this, blah, blah, blah. The truth is, I don't steal any of my shit. And the Heather, the one who's the main person doing this shit, here's your proof right here, bitch. If I steal beats, why is it that I'm banging out hits like this right here? Let's take a listen to this for a second. Take a listen to this shit. You hear that? that? You know what that sounds like? That sounds like hard work to me. And you think that what I'm doing ain't getting me somewhere? Guess what? I'm sitting on a multi, on a potential multi-million dollar business creating and selling my beats. And guess what? I've been getting linked up with actual shit, with actual fucking artists like the legendary and mysterious, which who I have right here on Facebook. Like, as you guys see right there, and mysterious right there, a legendary R&B artist. Who actually fucks with my shit. And if that ain't enough, let me, let me show you something here. So we just try? Let's go here to this. Oh, what's this? Envy Serious on Instagram? And why is it that people like this man right here, legendary Jeff Hardy, even fucks with my shit? The legend Jeff fucking Hardy fucks with my shit. So, you want to talk about somebody that's not a business savvy bitch? Look at yourself. And as for the fucking Michael Tucker dude, who I know ain't the real Michael Tucker, you're a fake ass. And another one, you fake as fuck too. Because, see, unlike y'all, I'm actually fucking business smart. Okay? See, that whole entire time, that I wasn't fucking doing a damn thing these last six months. I was actually building connections with people like MV Sterius and people like Jeff Hardy who actually fuck with my music, who fuck with my craft, who enjoy what I do, who love seeing me progress. See, music isn't just about creating music all the fucking time, every single time. It's about relationships with artists and building contacts and a brand. Now, y'all can sit there and try to steal my shit all you want, but guess what, motherfuckers? I can easily get y'all's asses on several copyright claims because guess what? I own the Driftwork Beats brand. That is my fucking brand. I own that shit. I bought that shit flat out literally a couple days ago. I have full soul ownership of Driftworks Beats. That is my company, my brand. Now, for all y'all artists out there that actually do need some good ass fucking fire beats, be sure to check out the beat shop down below. And if y'all are fans, man, I actually do have my official merch shop up and running.
No, you ain't another one, man. You fake as fuck, dog. And another one, you stupid fake. You fake as fuck, nigga. Get up out of here with that shit. And, like, what y'all don't fucking realize, man, all y'all motherfucking trolls, like, y'all are dumb as fuck, honestly, man. Especially you, Heather. You want to sit there and say that I steal beats? Bitch, what do you call this? What do you call this shit right here? This is not a stolen beat. This is a made from the ground up. I'll even show you the fucking bones and the pattern of this shit. Look. Right there is the fucking drone pattern. And then right below it in the chord section is the fucking chord progression. That's not fucking stolen. That's made from literally the ground up. Look. See, I'll even play just this back. Now, let's play the chords back. Now, you put them together. You get this. That don't sound stolen to me. So, try again, bitch. You ain't fooling nobody. Hell, I'll even show you what I used to make the fucking beat skip. Which is this right here, and here's the pattern that I used to make it fucking skip like that. It's called Gross Beat. So, try again, bitch. And yeah, you're right, I actually am. I'm literally in the process of fucking editing this beat. I'm literally working on the... where I feel like it needs to, you know, fade out into the chords. Matter of fact, why don't we finish this beat up right quick? Now, I know it might seem weird what I'm doing, but I'm actually using this to measure where I want my shit to be.
right there. All right, now let's play this thing back from start to finish, literally. Dude, I could actually probably, I'd probably end up doing a song over this shit, I don't know. I may end up spinning some bars over this, I don't know, man. Well, I'm definitely thinking about it, but I don't know. I don't know if I want to throw this one up in the beat shop or not, I don't know. Let's let that last little bit right there ride out to the very end. Yo, this shit's fucking fire, dude. Not even gonna lie, this is sick. Now, I do kind of want to extend that last bar right there, because that last bar right there is fucking sick, dude. And now that that is done, we're actually going to render that beast down, because that is fucking sick. That is straight up freaking dopeness. Now I'm my Pepsi over here, move my keyboard down here, and we'll name this thing, render it down, and I'll show you guys more proof of what I'm working on.
Got that bitch rendered down. And it's rendering right now. As y'all can see right there, the bitch currently rendering. Now, for all y'all that want to sit there and shit. And say that, oh, I'm not going to get anywhere with my music and blah, blah, blah. Well, here's your proof that I'm actually getting somewhere, motherfuckers, because guess what? Think about this. I sell a pack of 10 beats for $5 to 10 people a day, every day, for an entire year, every single day of the fucking year. Every day of the week, non just non-stop. Let me show y'all something. Y'all think I'm joking when I say that I'm sitting on a freaking multi-million dollar business? Let's see, where's it at? Here is the math problem plus what I put into it work-wise. What's that number right there at the bottom? What's that say? Oh yeah, eleven point eleven million eight hundred eighty-eight thousand seven hundred fifty. And that's the thing. Another one. I'm just now building my brain back up. See, what you don't realize is that in the music industry, it ain't just about making music. It ain't just about making sales. It's about making connections. You fucking moron. It ain't about making fucking sales every day. It's about making connections with other people. It ain't about doing music all the time. See, if you do music all the time and you don't make connections, you're not going to get anywhere. When you start to make connections and you start to build relationships with artists and other producers and shit like that, you start to build your brand. That's when you start to build your brand, which is what I've been doing these last six months. Is fucking taking, making these connections, and I chose just now to put my plan into action because I am business smart. I've built my connections up over these last fucking six months because I know what the real artists out there are looking for. I know what they want. They want high-end beats for a real low price, and you don't get much better than $5 for a pack of 10 beats. You don't get that much better, if at all. And guess what? Lower prices bring in more sales. And more sales bring in more profit. And more profit leads to me being financially stable. But see, what y'all don't realize is at that low of a price, I'm going to gain fucking customers like fucking crazy. Why? Because I know what the artist is looking for. I know what they want. They want good beats at a real low price. Okay. And when, think about this. I sell a pack of 10 beats to 10 people a day, every day. Think about this for a minute. Think about this. I sell a pack of 10 beats to 10 different people every day, right? They hear that shit. They buy it. They're going to want to go and tell their friends. And then that person's friends is going to tell more people. Which in turn is going to bring in more customers. And in the long run, more customers ultimately means more business. And more business means more money. And more money means more profit. And more profit means financial stability. So you see, I'm not as fucking dumb as y'all fucking think. I'm not stupid. I'm actually business smart. I have y'all fucking idiotic trolls that want to run your mouths. Because see, while y'all are sitting there running your mouths, I'm going to be sitting back well off. See, while I'm sitting here well off, y'all stupid motherfuckers are still going to be trolling, still be doing your dumb shit. But guess what? If y'all want to sit there and steal my shit, go ahead, because guess what? I ain't letting y'all motherfuckers stop me. And even if y'all do try to have my site shut down, my beat shop shut down, or my production merch shop shut down, guess what? I can easily re-out this shit, you stupid fucks, because I have everything I need to build the shit back up. So y'all may as well give the fuck up on trying to stop me, because it's never gonna fucking happen, bitch.
So y'all want to sit there and talk shit? See, that's y'all's problem. You like to talk shit. I actually try to do shit, okay? Unlike y'all motherfuckers, I actually do something with my life. I'm actually trying to get somewhere my, with my shit. Unlike y'all stupid motherfuckers that want to run y'all's mouths. Y'all are dumb as fuck. That's why while y'all are down here, I'm going to be up here. And guess what? There ain't not one of you motherfuckers that's ever going to stop me, bitch. But shout out to the real fucking music artists out there holding it down like my boy Bradley, my boy Charles, my homie and brother Eric Scrubwell. Every motherfucker that I fuck with that fucks with me. What up to all y'all crazy ass fucks? I fucking love y'all, man. Shout out to MB Stereos. What's up, girl? Fucking love your music, man. Keep on putting that shit out. Fucking love it. But uh, like I said, to all the real fans, I do want to pick up some Driftworks Beats merch. The link to that and to all the artists out there that I do want to pick up a pack of 10 beats for 5 bucks on my beat shop. The link is in the description so y'all can head over there. Check those out. I need to get back to work so I got shit to do, y'all. I'll catch y'all later, man. Peace.